Okay, if you really want to do the corner nicely, you can Okay So how do you fold around here? What you do, you cut it like this This part you fold in, right? This part you fold in. Now, cut diagonally here, like a 45 degree miter. Just be careful you don't cut yourself, right? you back okay now you have to lift this part up and take this part out there's another piece here now when you fold this back try to pull on it a little bit so that the seam would match Right, you see here how the seam matches perfectly. The pattern doesn't match that well, but imagine this would be your corner. You won't be able to see the seam, that's the idea. There's another cut that you might be interested in. It's actually like doing um, wallpapering. You can overlap two pieces of material when you try to make like a, like a seam that is almost seamless. Let's see here. Let's do it freehand. Okay, when you have two pieces, you overlapped it and you just cut it straight down, right? This is like wallpapering, right? This is pretty sticky. Right, so now you're left with the red and the white, and you just press it together. And you would have the edge of the black and the red. When they meet, they are like perfect. It won't be crooked. So that's the idea when you do vinyl wrapping. Of course, this is just uh, pretty straightforward. I don't know how to do the curves and all that. You know, those would be much more complicated. Yeah. So, this. Looking good. This is where the hinge is. Now, this might be difficult to cover, but at least I got the big part of the back and the front covered. So I don't have to paint it. So that's a big plus. And this being this being plywood is kind of ugly, so... Okay. That's 
just like the side panel. And this is the back. There's a little, a few bumps here because the plywood is not completely flat because there's some screw holes here so I had to use some wood filler okay now I have to make a cut yeah. so I'm um, doing the edge So this stuff is pretty sticky. Okay. So this is the end panel. This is the front. Applying a little heat so that it will shrink a little bit. And hopefully when um wouldn't come unglued. Yeah. Okay. Bottom and the side. Do this. It's not a perfect job, but even on close watch, uh, it's not too bad, right? Not too bad. The seams are not too bad and how flat would the surface be depends on how flat your wood is.